Hello, this is BBC News. I'm David Eads with the latest headlines for viewers in the UK and around the world. Ten people have been killed in a mass shooting by a lone gunman at a grocery store in the US city of Buffalo. The 18-year-old suspect who drove for a number of hours to reach the supermarket has been taken into police custody. He took his the gun, he put it down, he did put something on his feet, he took his vest off and then he got on his hands and knees and got on his back and then they arrested him. The mayor of Kharkiv tells the BBC Russian troops have withdrawn from his city, which has been under constant bombardment since the invasion began. US pro-choice supporters protest across the country ahead of a Supreme Court decision which is expected to overturn the country's long-established right to abortion. Thank you for supporting Ukraine. This victory is for every Ukrainian. Slava Ukraini! Yep, they won it. Ukraine takes the Eurovision Song Contest. Favourites from the start, they won the public vote to take the title. Hello, thanks very much for being with us uh, here. We start with the news coming out of New York State that 10 people have been killed in a shooting at a supermarket in the city of Buffalo. Three others have been injured. The FBI say they're investigating the incident as both a hate crime and a case of racially motivated violent extremism. 11 of the 13 victims were African-American. An 18-year-old man has been arrested at the scene. He hasn't been officially named by the authorities. Police do say the suspect entered the busy supermarket before then opening fire. He also used a camera to live stream the attack. He was described as very heavily armed and had a tactical helmet and gear. Well, one eyewitness at the scene described the moment he saw the gunman being arrested. Um, after he came out, he had an army suit on.